So this sirat is a sirat which goes over which goes over the hellfire and leads to Jannah. The issue is, is that this word sirat means in the Arabic language a wide lane, a wide uh, a tariq, a wide path. So this path is a very wide path, okay? Um, it's not something which is like thin. But then what we find, okay, is that there's other ahadith speaking about the characteristics of the sirat. So we're going to get into that. But then he goes on to say, It's the bridge which is over the hellfire and Jannah. Uh, people are going to traverse it in accordance to their actions. People are going to traverse it in accordance to their actions, okay? So, the person who, as Sheikh uh, uh, Ibn Uthaymin says, the person who yani, uh, uh, um, did khair in this dunya, he's going to find it easy there. The level in which you had iqbalun ala deen, the way in which you accepted and ran towards the religion, is going to be in, uh, is going to also determine how you cross that bridge. And we ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to save us and allow us to pass through the bridge very quickly. And subhanAllah, bil munasabah, I don't like bridges. I don't even like bridges. So even just the thought of a bridge is already scary. Me, I don't like bridges. When I'm always on London Bridge, something like that, I think subhanAllah, wa'ala Allah just makes this capsize. I always just get very scared. But just when I think about the technology of a bridge and how you have to put it, how did they make this bridge, you know, Firm on the ocean. It's just very subhanAllah human engineering, something else. The way some there will be some people that will cross that bridge. And this is all from a hadith of the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Ibn Taymiyyah is just saying in his own words and taking some wording of the hadith and taking uh, his own words. He says, من يمر كلمح البصر. People that are going to pass that at the blinking of an eye. كلمح البصر. Okay, people are going to pass it that quick. ومن يمر كالبرق. People that are going to move like thunder, like lightning, they're just going to move quickly. So it's going to be very quick. Okay. And then he goes on to ومن هم يمر كالريح. Some people are going to pass it like wind, like a, like a wind. They're going to come and they're going to go. No doubt, a wind, there's no doubt whatsoever that a wind is very fast, but it's not like a lightning strike. And it's not like a lamh al basar. It's not like, would you call it, blink of an eye. And then he goes on to say, وَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَمُرُّكَ الْرِيحُ وَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَمُرُّكَ الْفَرَسِ الْجَوَّادِ and then there's ones that will, fart, will go like a, like a horse, like a, yeah, like a very strong faras al-jawad, you know, subhanAllah, almost like, like a war horse, like a war of a fit and ready and a strong, you know, if you like, a stallion kind of thing, a, 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 a gallop, you know, it's going to be galloping, that's what people are going to be galloping like a horse. وَمِنْهُمْ يَمُرُّ كَرُكَّابِ ibl. And then there's going to be people that, they're not like a horse, but they're moving like a person, who is riding a camel. A camel's a bit slower than a horse, but he's going as if they're riding a camel. And then he goes on to say, وَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَعْدُوا عَدْوًا يعني People that they're going to be walking fast. They're going to be walking fast. You know, they're going to be walking, you know, almost like, I'm not going to say speed walking, but people are going to be moving quite fast on the bridge. وَمِنْهُ مَنْ يَمْشِي مَشْيًا And then the people that are going to just walk on the bridge. People that they are just going to walk on the bridge. وَمِنْهُ مَنْ يَزْحَفُ زَحْفًا And then there's people that they're going to be walking on all fours. They're going to be crawling on the bridge. وَمِنْهُ مَنْ يُخْطَفُ خَطْفًا وَيُلْقَى فِي جَهَنَّمْ And then there's going to be people that they are picked off. They are picked off and they are thrown into the Jahannam. فَإِنَّ الْجِسْرَ عَلَيْهِ كَلَالِيبِ For indeed, the, this, 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 this sirat, this jisr, has hooks, okay? تَخْطِفُ النَّاسَ بِعْمَالِهِمْ Takes people in accordance to their deeds. If their deeds are not enough, they'll be thrown into the, 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 the hellfire. Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, like I said, described this bridge as ضَحْضٌ مَزِلَّةٌ ضَحْدٌ مَزِلَّةٌ يعني Something where if you were to lose your bearings whilst, whilst riding on it, you, you, you can slip and you can, you can fall off. But then the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam described it as something else. He said, هو أدق, okay, أَدَقُّ مِنَ الشِّعْرِ okay, وَأَحَدُّ مِنَ السَّيْفِ 
it is more finer than um, a hair and it is more sharper than a knife. So a person has to ask themselves if it's a, if it's a sirat and the meaning of a sirat in the Arabic language is a wide is a wide uh, is a wide path how can it now be okay uh, okay how can it be something which is thank you shukran how can it be something which is uh, what do you call it uh, uh, thinner than a hair sharper than a knife the statement is this an yaqul al insanu allahu a'lam for ben say allah knows best how because these masail are masail of the dunya, of the akhirah. These masail are the masail of the akhirah, and that which happens in the akhirah does not necessarily have to follow the same laws of that which happened in the dunya. Does everyone understand that? We said that, for example, on Yawm Al-Qiyamah, Al-Insan Yuljimuhu Al-Araq. That a person will be will be will be unable to speak because like his like a Yuljimuhu uh, Al-Araq. He'll be unable to speak. He'll be made silent, like he's got a nozzle over his mouth by way of sweat. So the akhirah and the dunya cannot be uh, uh, compared. Okay, they cannot be uh, uh, compared. That which happens in the akhirah happens in the akhirah, and that which happens in the dunya happens in the dunya, and the two don't necessarily have to be. Uh, 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 the same so this is يعني, uh, what's going to happen okay and then we obviously we know that some Muslims are going to fall into the hellfire as well العلماء يقولون, the ulama say that a Muslim لا يعذب كالكافر a Muslim will not be uh, punished okay in the hellfire like a non-Muslim his punishment is not going to be the same and there's other hadith which talk about the a'adha, the sujood, yani will not be the, 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 um, the what do you call it, the, uh, the, the limbs that a Muslim does, uses to go into sujood, the seven sab'ati a'adhum, the seven limbs, will not be, will not be affected if he goes into the hellfire. And then we move after that to a stage known as al-qantara, al-qantara. And the qantara, and again, the qantara in the in the Arabic language means al sagir. It means a small bridge. اختلف العلماء في القنطرة. The ulama have اختلاف on the qantara, the kayfiyah of the qantara. The, 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 how, 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 how is it? How is it this, uh, the alignment of the qantara? If we're going to pass a bridge, what's the qantara? The ulama, some of them are of the opinion that the qantara is it a mulhaq? Is it a small attachment of the main bridge, the sirat, or not? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows best. But the qantara, the meaning of the qantara and the usage of the qantara is not for, it's not like the, the sirat. The qantara is, 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 is for the specific, for these specific reasons that we're going to speak about right now. يعني فمن مر على الصراط دخل الجنة. Whoever, whoever, يعني, uh, what do you call it? Whoever passes the sirat, okay, dakhal al jannah, okay, will enter al jannah. And then he says, فَإِذَا عَبَرُوا عَلَيْهِ When they cross the, 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 the what do you call it? Uh, uh, when they cross this bridge, وَقَفُوا عَلَىٰ قَنْطَرَةٍ بَيْنَ الْجَنَّةِ وَالنَّارِ They're going to stop at this place known as al-qantara 